Today we're opening some old school Yu-Gi-Oh packs. What's up guys, we're back with another epic opening video. In this video, I was sent some packs by GG Vision, and then I have some other packs that I threw in to make a complete opening. It's gonna be a lot of fun stuff, so let's see what he sent. He sent a note. This is from GG Vision. Congrats on 160K subs, you madman. I included a giveaway this time. We'll be doing a lot more on my channel as well for those who want to check it out. Keep it up, and I'm sure you'll be at 200K in no time. P.S. I promise I won't tell Chelsea about you and Pequeno Moth. Thank you, I appreciate that. But the giveaway, I'll show what he got. The giveaway he sent appears to be an Ancient Sanctuary pack, which is pretty cool. So you guys can win a sealed Ancient Sanctuary pack, vintage pack. So that's a pretty cool giveaway. Just like the video, be subscribed, turn on notifications, check out GG Vision's channel. It'll be in the description. He also sent a clip of his newest video, so check this out. I found my dad's lifeboat missing after the storm, so it makes total sense that he made no attempt to come find me afterwards, or we had no emergency plan set in motion in case something bad happened. I even built a monument overlooking the sea to guide him home. Yeah, that's a monument, all right. Also known as a grave. It's the tsunami! Okay, okay, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna ignore that insanely dedicated mailman as best I can. Point out the fact that his father knew where he lived well enough to deliver him this package with a single card and a note that says don't give up instead of just, you know, going to f***ing see him. All right, there you go. Thanks again, GG Vision. Here are the packs he sent us. He sent us eight packs. He sent a Rise of Destiny pack. We've got a Soul of the Duelist, Ancient Sanctuary. We've got a Dark Crisis. That's pretty cool. We've got a couple Legacy of the Valiant, Laval. And then we've got a Grand Creators and Power of the Elements Blisters. So we have all of those eight packs. So I need to add a few more packs so we're not having like a three minute video. We have Power of the Duelist. That's a hobby. We got three of those. We've got three of Duelist Pack Yusei. Then we have three Duelist Pack Crow, five Tactical Masters, and then a Pharaonic Guardian Blister Pack. Okay, let's just get right into the opening. There's a lot of cool packs to open. I think we're going to start with the grand creators that he sent us. So let's see if we can pull something big. I've been looking for big pulls. You guys saw my top 25 pulls the other day. Let's see if we can have one that I'm like, dang, I wish I had, you know, not posted that video yet because this is such a good pull. That's what we need. You need, need an amazing pull. Let's see if we can get a nice collector rare out of grand creators. No. Gaga, Gaga Koo Punk Wagon. Oh, look at these texts. They're super shifted. That's pretty cool. Draco back. All right. Next, let's do a Duelist Pack Yusei 2. This appears to not be first edition. So I guess they made an unlimited of this pack. That's kind of weird because, like, there's not a lot of cards in here. I'm surprised they got an unlimited print. Level Leader. We got a Skill Successor. Remember that one from Duel Links? Level Warrior and Release Restraint Wave. I guess there were some good cards in here. Like, maybe Stardust was in here. Wait. It says Stardust Dragon Assault Mode, but uh, that's a little different. All right. Next pack. Duelist Pack Crow. This one is first edition. So I don't know if they came out with an unlimited for this one. Probably not. It just has a few Blackwing cards. I don't know what the ultra rare is though. It might be the oh Mistral the Silver Shield. Oh, the Black Wing Dragon. Super rare. Alright, that's pretty cool. Black Armed Wing's pretty good too. We got the Black Wing Arm Wing and Gus the Back Blast. That is just quite the name right there. Okay, a Black Wing Dragon. That's pretty sick. I'll take that. Arm Wing is also a nice pull. Pretty good start. Let's go into this Rise of Destiny pack that he sent us. First edition. Let's see if we can pull a Dekoichi Ultimate Rare Zingzen Hu. One of my favorite trap cards of all time. I just really like it. Let's see if we can get something big. Woodborg and Pachi. Moki Moki King. Woodborg and Pachi. That's strange. Okay. Creator Incarnate. Zingzen Hu. Very nice. Harpy's Heading Ground. Harpy Girl. Homunculus, the alchemic being. And... Oh! Silent Swordsman level 3. That's a nice card. The Ultras are 1 in 24, so it's actually really hard to pull these. Wow. Silent Swordsman level 3. I mean, you open a box and sometimes you don't even get them. All right. Tactical Masters. Collector Rare. Incoming. Let's go. Let's pull something amazing. I think this might be Euro Print, so I think we can get it at the back. Oh, Vader of the Dark. Let's just keep going. Labyrinth uh, Ku Clock. We got the Malice and the Runic Flashing Fire. That is just a... Super rare, not too great there. Let's go. All right, Duelist Pack, you say. Can we get a foil out of here? These are not guaranteed. We got a zero guard now. Pretty cool. Salt mode activate. Road Warrior. This is a synchro I've like never seen. Road Warrior. Very cool. These two, the original synchros though just seem cool for some reason. Even if they suck, they seem really cool. Let's try a Legacy of the Valiant. If we get a Ghost Rare out of here, that'd be pretty sick. I don't think I've ever pulled this Ghost. I don't even remember which one it is. It's like C32 something or something like that. I don't remember. Swordsman from a Distant Land. Cool artwork on this one. I will give it that. Overlay Sentinel. Gravekeeper's Ambusher. Black Brachios. So yeah, in the Dino deck back in the day. do do Buster. By back in the day, I mean Duel Links. Uh, Gilla Good... Gilla... Gilla Gill Lancer? Rose Witch? Okay, weird. Sylvan Komushrumo. And a Mighty Warrior. All right, pretty cool. Tactical Masters, what else are we going to get here? 
Let's get some good. We've got Imperial Iron Wall, Lilith, Lady of Lament, Labyrinth Archfiend, Seon, Quick Booster, Bear Blocker, and we have a Valence Genesis Grand Duke. Just a super, so no big deal there. Nothing too crazy. Let's do one more uh, Tactical Masters because I do have five of these. Let's see if we can get a Collector Rare. How about even an Ultra Rare? Pendulum Fusion. Come on. Labyrinth Kuklok. Duelist Alliance. Valence Mad at Marcus. We got the Invader of Darkness. Cosmic Cyclone. And Labyrinth Barrage. Look at that little, like, uh, that looks like a pop figure. Does it not? That little, uh, that little knight looks like a pop figure. Okay, let's try our other Legacy of the Valiant from GG Vision. Let's see if he can bless us with a Ghost Rare. Um, let's try, because, I mean, many times we've battled him, and he's pulled the Ghost Rares. He's never blessed us with a Ghost Rare, so it's about time. Gorgonic Ghoul, Snapdragon, there we go. We got the Release Reverse Burst, Dark Artist, Xyz Avenger, Ghost Trick Jack Frost, Sylvan Peacekeeper, and we have... Okay, I like this card the best. Sylvan Peacekeeper. Now that's pretty cool. Look at those binoculars. Got a little... Is that a flower gun? That is, And that guy looks nervous. That That's a cool card. I like that art. All right, back to Tactical Master. So far, our big pull has been a Silent Swordsman. Also, the Blackwing was pretty cool as well. We have Astrograph Sorcerer, Quick Booster, and Espel Fragrance. Pretty nice. Malice Lady of Lament. Nazuki, the Valence Ninja. Duelist Alliance. That's named after the set. And we have a Labyrinth Setup. Okay, so the, so far those are not great. Nothing much going on there. Let's do our Pote Pack from GG Vision. There's a lot of great cards out of Pote. We know this. Let's just pull a Starlight and just be, just be done with it, you know? Why even worry about the other cards when you can pull a Starlight? I don't remember if it's four. I think it's four? Because there's no rare anymore? I'm pretty sure it's four. All right, Melfi Wally. Sprite Red. Nightmel the Dark Bonder. Overfusion, Scar of the Vindred, Venuslip of the Thawing Mountains, Crosskeeper, Amaze Attraction, Thrill Train, and oh, that was it. Albaz the Ashen. I thought there was one more card, but there wasn't. Okay, unfortunately, nothing in that one. Our final Tactical Masters pack. We still have a lot of nice packs left, though. We've saved a lot of them for the end. Senate Switch, pretty cool. Lilith, Lady of Lament, Trap Trick, Valence, Voltage, Viscount, Anti Spell Fragrance, Bear Blocker, and Hey, it's an ultra rare! Mamanaka, -ma 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 the Valence United. We got an ultra rare. It's probably the worst one in the set, but it's an ultra rare. We will take that every day. We have a Yusei coming up. This is our last pack of Yusei. Come on, Yusei. Let's go. We got the Prevention Star. Yusei! We got the Slip Summit and Turret Warrior. All right, Turret Warrior, Love Leader, Setting Lost Stars. Some good cards back in the day in there. Not bad, not bad. Do we still have Crow? I think we have, oh, we have two more Crow packs. Come on, Crow. Let's see what you can get. We haven't opened any Power of the Duels yet. Let's open those up next. Raptor Wing Strike. And a Black Return. Super rare. Very nice. Oh, Gale. That's a great card. And then Black Wing Fane. The Steel Chain. There's the classic Black Wing. Got to pull that out. That is awesome. And then a super rare Black Return. That is pretty cool. All right. Power of the Duelist. First edition. Let's go. Let's do this. First pack, we have potentially an ultimate rare. Let's go. One, two, three. Here we go. We have Destiny Mirage. Blade Master. Crop Circles, Circles of Crops, Orbital Bombardment, Black Terra, Synthetic Seraphim, Amulet's Rescue Roid, Cyber Summon Blaster. Wait, is that it? Oh, yeah, we don't get a full. Ah, oh, dang it, that's the end. All right, nothing in that Power of the Duelist. It's okay. Got a lot of packs to go. Well, a few packs to go. Let's do our last Crow, and then we'll get into real heavy hitters for the rest of the way. Can we get whatever the Ultra Rare in this set is? I'm not sure. We got a Mistral. I think it's it's usually this card, so I'm going to do this. So this is the Rare. We got the Boar of the Spear. Cool card. Blackwing Fane, Steel Chain, you love to see it. We got the Anti-Reverse, Strategy Card, Blackwing Mistral, Silver Shield, and we have a Ghibli, the Searing Wind. Okay, not that crazy. We did get a Blackwing Fane, the Steel Chain, though. Well, that's pretty cool. Let's do the Soul of the Duelist Unlimited pack. This is a cool set. It has Horus, it has Horus level 4, 6, 8. I mean, all ultimate rare potential. I mean, really cool stuff. Other good stuff as well, but those are the ones I really like. Heavy Slump, let's see what we can get. Element Soldier. The Graveyard in the Fourth Dimension. Oh, Rux and Special. We got the Ultimate Baseball Kid. He's into sports. Fusion Weapon. Skull Dog Marin. Oh, no. A lost dog that wandered off a thousand years ago. He's still waiting for his master to come for him. <laughs> so sad. Arm Dragon Level 3. What else can we get? Arm Dragon Level 7 would be sick. Cemetery Bomb. And here we go. Will it be a foil? Rafflesia Seduction. I don't know who's getting seduced by that, but you got a problem if you are. Back to Pote. Or not Poke. I keep saying Poke. Pod. Pod. P-O-T-D. First edition. Hobby pack. Can we get an ultimate rare? One, two, three, four. We have 
Blade Master, Alien Hunter, Brainwashing Beam, Black Stego, Black Terra, Orbital Bombardment, Rescue Roid, Destiny Hero Fearmonger, and we have a oh Super Vehicle Jumbo Drill. Thought that might be some big because it was a fusion. Could have been an ulti -E hero, but hey. Super rare, we'll take it. Ancient Sanctuary. We've opened a bunch of Ancient Sanctuary recently, which is not usually a set you open a lot of, but we have opened a lot of it recently. We have an unlimited pack here from GG Vision. Let's see what we can get. Did he send us a foil pack? Let's hope he did. Delta Attacker. Fiend Scorpion. Labyrinth of Nightmare. Regenerating Mummy. Nubian God. Backfire. Three Humblacuda. Earthquake. And we have a Thieving Nightmare, man. This is a nightmare. I pull this card every time I open Ancient Sanctuary. <sighs> hey, if you guys win this pack for the giveaway, hopefully you do not get a Thieving Nightmare. I'm sending that luck over to you guys. I probably cursed you, but sorry. Let's do Power of the Duelist, our last pack here. And then we have a Dark Crisis and a First Edition Pharaonic Guardian Blister. <sighs> Let's go. All right, almost, almost dropped the pack. One, two, three, four. Let's get an ultimate rare out of here. We have Crop Circles, like in those alien movies. Destiny Hero Defender, very nice. We're still recording everything, I think. Nice. Destiny Mirage. We got the Bite Lawn. Fear Monger. The Accord Connection Zone. Foscal Excavation. I said that wrong. Alien Gray. Is this the foil? Is this the rare? What is it? Can it be something good? It is just a spell calling rare. No. That's okay. No need to panic. Dark Crisis will save us. We are going to pull something big like Exodia Necros. Unlimited original Dark Crisis pack. This reminds me of when we opened 24 of these early in my channel's life and we pulled two Exodia Necros. The coolest moment. Well, not ever, but one of the coolest. Precious Cards from Beyond. Goblin of Greed, Archfiend's Oath, Vilepawn Archfiend, oh, Ruxin Special, Ray of Hope, Nintin Dogs on the DS, Gyaku Geyer Penda, Dark Scorpion Mene the Thorn, is this it? Is this the foil? Will it be something good? It is a Kaiser Glider Ultra Rare. Yes, that's pretty good. It's not a fantastic card, but it is an Ultra Rare from Dark Crisis. That's a nice pull. We'll take that. All right, quite the opening today. We've actually had some pretty solid pulls. It hasn't been amazing, but it also hasn't been really bad, like some of our openings recently. We're finishing it off with a Ferrana Guardian pack. I'm letting you guys know I'm slowly opening these myself. I do have them available on Ruxin34.com. I have a couple packs left, so if you want to buy them before I sell out or slash open them all, which is what's probably going to happen, check it out. Because uh, I think one guy opened one. He got a Donza Lug. I've opened some. I did get one Lava Golem, but these were not from, like, a specific box so you know anything can happen with these so first edition hopefully we'll pull something cool right here but i still i think i have maybe four or five left i gotta check over there all right first edition packs let's go before i sell all of them and speaking of i think we've sold out of the front guardian box by the time you guys see this or the box break if you haven't check it out if you have if we have sold out of it there's probably another box break up so check that out dice shark first edition that's a good card trap dust shoot that's an amazing card that's about like seven bucks Gravekeeper's Curse, two of the best commons already. That's pretty good. Uh, Banner of Courage, nice. We've got a Eight Claws Scorpion. This is also a great set for commons, so you can get some good value there. Swarm of Scarabs, good for those, um, you know, what are those called? The munching camels or whatever. Narrow Pass, all right, nice. Molten Behemoth, is this the next card? Is it a foil? Is it the next card? Is this it? King Tiger Wang Yu, all right, it's just a rare, but this is actually a good rare for like go format. Pretty strong effect. There's someone driving very loud outside. King Tiger Wang Hu. Not gonna lie, not a bad opening. Go check out GG Vision if you guys want to check out his new video and also all the videos on his channel. I'll have a link down below. Thanks again for sending me those packs. Uh, we had some actual pretty good pulls out of them. So this was a fun video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, make sure to subscribe to the channel. Shout out to Tone Fo Show, Daxter, Tomato Juice, JT Cho, TCG Trusted Cards, Puffins of Doom, Ernesto Deanda, Dizzy, Flexi Boy, Hoppus, Choice 333, Micycle, James Jance, Frankie Martinez, and Unatai Show, Christopher Ward, Ian. Musa, Junior Barding, Mike Nance, Mimic Echo, Shadowfall, and Thomas McLean. Thank you guys for supporting the channel, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.